I'm actually not the hugest fan of Valentine's Day, if I'm going to be honest with you. I am a proponent of making every day really special. I wake up personally every day with the intention of making my wife and the people in my life know how how treasured they are, how important they are to me. I'm very big about expressing gratitude to people and everyday people on Valentine's Day. Take Valentine's Day and make that part of your daily habit. Make that part of your weekly habit. Find ways to communicate with, use Valentine's Day as, a, as an opportunity to ask yourself, how can I better show up for my partner? And then make that part of your daily habit. Don't wait for Valentine's Day. Do it every single week. You can't rinse repeat relationships. That's, that's, uh, that's a recipe for stagnation. You absolutely can't do that. You have to, so look, we all want to get into relationships because we want the security and certainty that comes with being in a relationship. But the flip side to that coin is that the excitement has to go away when you have certainty and predictability and you know somebody's going to be there for you. So it's imperative that you find alternate ways to keep things exciting, keep things unpredictable. You can't ever stop dating your partner. You can't ever stop courting your partner. You have to put energy into your relationship. It's like a plant. If you stop watering it, it's going to dry up and die. For the latest stories, be sure to visit E! Online and download the E! Online app. I actually had a question about the packages. Speaking of packages, yes. yes. You're still cute. You're still cute. It's a lot of makeup. Yeah. Is Taylor Swift giving away her awards to her squad? This is so true.